Hello. In this tutorial, we are going to teach you, how you can encrypt and decrypt the strings using Node.js and save them in MongoDB. We will be using Crypto Module from NPM. So let's go ahead and create a new folder for our project. Open the folder in your code editor and create a file named server.js. Then open that folder in your terminal or command prompt. And run npm init to initialize the project. For this tutorial, we are going to use few modules, so let's install them in your project. We will be using Express for routing, HTTP, MongoDB as database, Crypto to encrypt and decrypt, and EJS to display HTML pages. We will also be using a module named NoDemon. This will automatically restart the server if there is any change in server file. And start the Node.js server using Node.daemon. First, open your server.js file and initialize the Express framework. Then create HTTP server. Here we will place our other modules later in this tutorial. And start the server at port 3000 or pick from environmental variables. This will be used when your app is live or in production. And we will connect MongoDB here. Now, include MongoDB module. Mongo client will be used to connect with Mongo database. This will be our database name. Then include the crypto module. Set the encryption algorithm as ICE. Set private key, its length must be of 32 characters, I have already calculated length of this string. Then generate initialization vector, its length must be of 16 characters, for security you should always generate random 16 characters for initialization vector and not hard coded. So you can access your server from here. Then we are going to create a route that will accept a string from URL. Encrypt the string using ICE algorithm, our private key and initialization vector. You can also use initialization vector with random byte function directly here for more security. To save in MongoDB, you need to convert initialization vector to base 64.
And finally save initialization vector and encrypted string in MongoDB. And also display the encrypted string in the browser. This is the encrypted string for text hello world. It is also saved in MongoDB along with its initialization vector. Now we need to display all our encrypted strings saved in database. To display the data in browser, we will be using EJS as templating engine. Get all strings from database in descending order. We need to create a folder named Views. And inside it, a file named index.tjs. In this file, we will simply create an HTML table. Loop through all the data returned from MongoDB. Create an anchor tag to decrypt the string. So this is the encrypted string. Let me add another string. So now I need to decrypt it. We need to create this root in our server.js. Get the encrypted string object from database. Use the initialization vector from database to convert the encrypted string back to original string. And finally, display the decrypted string in the browser.